I think the two options here, you get the ball in Jordan Poole's hands, you allow him to create off the dribble. The other option is to run some sort of quick screening action for Clay Thompson. Green will inbound it with Lamb, DiVincenzo, Thompson, and Poole. Tied at 120, 6.3 to go in the fourth. Green gets it into Thompson, his jumper off the mark. Rebound out of bounds, and it's going to stay with Golden State. 2.6 to go. No timeouts remaining for either team. DiVincenzo to inbound. DiVincenzo finds Poole. He lays it in. 1.3 to go. And Poole gets the Warriors the lead. No timeout. Bay heaves. That's it. Golden State pulls off the comeback. And beats their rivals. 122. 120 to final. As DiVincenzo finds Poole for the game winner. I'll be honest with you, I didn't love Zaire Williams' initial body position. You're running an, an inbounds pass. The ball is underneath the basket. You've got to be underneath Jordan Poole there to start. He's on his side, preventing him from curling towards the wing. There's no one on that backside. Poole makes a beautiful read and gets a great pass from DiVincenzo for the tough finish. And not much Desmond.